don't use all your comedy gold before I start recording, Rick. Too late. Already shot my wad. Just. Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex of Corbin. Oh, I'm depleted. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you to our resource on Patreon. Follow us for Twitter account, subscribe, and hit the like button. And welcome. Uh, we are here right now at this moment. Here because the Greek god himself asked us. No, no, he didn't. But he dropped something. Uh, and it's uh, the and we're gonna pick it up. The next big Hindi film uh, after in of twenty twenty four, uh, and it's the new Hrithik Roshan film, <laughs> and Deepika Parkon and Anil Kapoor, you know who is who uh, who is just in everything, hey. and Sid Sid hey, Harth man, is also gonna... in this. Uh, hey, yeah. apparently, Kiara's uh, but, husband. Uh, but fighter is the title of it. I've obviously. Only thing I know about it outside of those people being in it is that it's a fighter pilot film. Um which makes sense. Um makes sense. but uh that other than that, oh I think it's also directed by the guy who did war, right? Is that is that correct? Or is it is it the guy that who did sounds pa- right? Or is it the guy that did Patan? It might be the guy that did Patan. Let me double check here. If it's Sidharth, it I think it's Patan. Siddharth Anand is he directed and wrote War Patan. Yeah, so both. Yeah, so we were both right. Um, so it should be a big <laughs> massive what? I just feel I realized that you said Siddharth, I thought Maholtra. <laughs> oh gotcha. <laughs> That's why I said Kiara. Because we gotcha. just watched that, you know. Yeah, yeah, the Cuff with Quran. So anyway, if you, you yeah, want to yeah. see that, it's on Patreon. It's obviously going to be That's blocked for about a month. But anyways, yeah. let's just get into this, huh, Rick? Let's get into it. All right, ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Nice. <laughs> nice. It looks like it could be a lot of fun. Um, with that director, it does, that, it, and that's kind of what you expect, though. Uh, a big, massive, over-the-top Bollywood action movie with, uh, with, a, with a lot of fun. Gotta say, the visuals look pristine. Yeah, I, I am a little visuals worried. Look great. I am a little worried about the fight, uh, the, the stuff in the plane and how much that's going to take up the film because... Yeah, obviously it's going to be all CGI anytime they're in the plane because I don't think they're Tom Cruise in this, you know. Uh, <laughs> you can't expect anybody to be. Yeah, exactly. Really, you can't. Uh, you shouldn't. I didn't think they were bad, but uh, no, I they, thought it was. I, I do. I thought it was pristine. But I don't also want the entire like. I don't want a lot of it to be that because maybe they just showed us the best parts uh, of of the CGI and and because that 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 would be my biggest concern is that I know that all the flying is probably going to be all CGI, 
and um i don't i don't want that i don't want i want it i want it more to focus on you know like like all the other um uh i guess it's what is it tom uh there's a lot of error um what the fuck word am i looking for uh i have no idea no uh air force Air Force. Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever. With their fighter pilots, you know, uh, films, uh, yeah. but it's all mo- pr- primarily story about them on the ground as opposed to predominantly in the air. Although there was some really cool shots of the the fighter pilot and the the stopping, uh, like pulling out. I don't know what the move is called, but yeah, if the visual effects are great, I don't don't bother me how much time we spend in the in the in the planes and the flying. For me. Dang, the more the merrier. If we could be doing that a lot, and it, it's propelling the story, pun intended. Um, uh, I, I that looked really, really good. Yeah. They. Um, what What was your favorite out of Baton and War? Um, as a whole, War. Mm-hmm. But if Baton had been what the first half of it was into the second half, it would have been platonic because I really loved the first half. And I, it, the second half, I really enjoyed watching Salman Khan and, and Shah Rukh Khan yeah. working together. Yeah. But there was just something really just, uh, so sup- there were a lot more surprises for me about how good some things were with war. I was surprised the story was as good as it was. I was really excited to see how good Tiger was. Um, so yeah, uh, and this is so I would give I would give the edge I would give the edge to war. Uh, and this isn't part of obviously that universe, but being it no. a, a action movie and from that same director, that's what I would expect. I would expect that because if you were going to ask me what's what are my favorite military movies, I I would immediately jump to some other other films. Top of the list would be Uri. Um, yeah. Indian because war, specifically, war yeah. is war is an action film to me more than it is a military film. And I, I my suspicion, this may be, and that'd be very cool. This would be cool if it was a blending of both a real sense of the patriotic reality of a military film, but also have some of the bombast and the CGI of a big action thing like war. That would be pretty dang cool. Yeah. The, then again. Uh... The, it all looked great. The Pico looks like she was in a helicopter, and Rithik looked like he was flying the jet. I believed it. Uh, the the logline is an aspirational young man named Shum, Shamir uh, must overcome his obstacles after enlisting in the Indian Air Force in order to become a hero of the Indian Armed Forces. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Vague. Uh, I mean... You didn't get to see uh, a lot outside of it's going to be a patriotic act. How, how do they have any other like Air Force movies in terms of like fighter pilot kind of movies in well, India? There's a couple that we've seen the trailers to that we didn't see. Like I don't what? know how many there there are. What what the one that just recently? Uh, what didn't? Um, can Ghana do one recently where she was an Air Force pilot? You might be right. I don't think it did I well. I, and I don't think it was yeah, good. Thought, well, that's what that's what, that was correct. the word on the street, at least. Correct, um, yeah. Maybe you might be right there. Um, because obviously in the genre in Hollywood, the uh, Air Force, I mean, military movies are one thing, but then there's exactly. there's there's subgenres of of military movies of there's Air Force, um, Marines, you got you got um, yeah. Iraq, you got whatever, like <laughs> you got all different types. And everybody's going to compare this. You can't help it. Everyone's going to compare it to Maverick. Yeah, you kind of kind of have to, right? You, you, yeah, you can't help it because that that kind of raised the bar. And again. In raising the bar, it's no one's expecting anybody to do what Tom Cruise does, truly. But but as far as visuals, believability, story, things of that nature, it's kind of there. And I, I really do. Uh, I'm I like that a lot. I thought that was really an exciting trailer. Yeah. Have you seen some of the new things that um, the uh, planes can do? Is specifically the ones I saw were for a, a new American uh like they're insane they can 
<laughs> they could do that like now like they can I actually know. they can fly like this and they can stop they can land like they can... <laughs> i know <laughs> i've seen the, i've seen the videos of them now being able and it's not just our air, air force i think oh yeah they're all over yeah also indian air force as well where the jets can take off up and down yeah yeah it's unbelievable and, like in air they can do these insane things that it's like I don't, I don't even know how you do. So like when he did that move, which was a really cool move. Um, I'm looking forward to, it. I love Rithik. I love, uh, obviously he's a, he's a sexy man to look at. I mean, this is going to be a hard screen to look at for sure with Rithik and Topeka on screen all the time. I know it's just, I don't stock. It's just, it, could they get, yeah. Um, like get better looking people like on screen. Try at least, <laughs> uh, clearly you didn't try, uh, did, did uh you may have said this at the beginning and I'm not looking at IMDb did did Sid Harth also write this yeah but he also wrote yeah. almost all of the um or at least helped write all of the the spy universe so he was part of Tiger he was okay. obviously directed right. war and Baton. um but he he's been part of that whole thing but yeah he he's part of the story on this one cool but with a it's well, all looking team. forward to it and it's it's clearly a very smart move to release this thing on January twenty fifth. That's just, and I love that. I love that that patriotic moment of him getting out with the Indian flag behind him. That was awesome. Yeah, that's such a unique aspect of Indian films that that is mm -hmm. it's jarring if you're not used to it because of how blatantly patriotic it is. And that's not like normally you have to be a little more subtle with your. Um, patriotism um moments in films here just because people like like it's just too obvious sometimes <laughs> what right. they do in indians like It'll literally bringing out the american flag and yeah yeah for us it, for us it would be cheesy to go that far it doesn't it's not cheesy at all with indian yeah. military films it works and to coin a phrase we haven't heard in a long time when you watch that everybody how's the josh hi sir hi sir uh, Indeed, but I don't want to peek. I don't want to peek the uh, speakers here. Um, <laughs> I uh, I hope it's uh, I hope it's good. I'm looking forward to seeing the trailer to see more of the uh, the story and the acting. The story, um, yeah. Because obviously, with even if it's not like an acting driven film, you know you're going to get good performances out of these um, out of these leads at at minimum. Yeah. Um, so uh, G we thought December was the busy month. I think January, January is actually, is loading up. unless stuff starts getting pushed for January beginning, yeah. like starting the 12th, especially for Tamil, Tamil, it's a really big month for Tamil. Um, yeah. But at the end on the 24th, I think at least two or three films are also releasing around that time. Um, yeah. So it's a, it's a, it, that one's a big month. Anyways, let us know what you thought about the teaser. If you're excited for it and anything else we need to know down below. Josh!